The U.S. government's emergency small business lending program is out of money. Today, we learned the $349 billion program is tapped out. The White House sent this tweet demanding that Congress immediately increase funding for the Paycheck Protection Program. Treasury Secretary Steven Mnuchin and Democrats have been meeting today to try and get something done. Well, before running out of money, the government received more than one and a half million applications. And those who were able to apply are now starting to see the aid. KCTV 5's Nathan Vickers shows us how that money will help one Kansas City staple. It's the kind of place you can find by following your nose. I'm smelling that, that good smoke. Even through a mask. You know, I could eat here five days a week. Matt McQuality was part of today's lunch rush at Woodyard Barbecue in KCK. A group of carryout customers helping care on Malloy's restaurant stay smoking. We are uh, trucking along. In fact, I've seen a, a bit of an uptick the last few days. But even with carryout orders, most restaurants are struggling alongside other small businesses. Woodyard says it was on the verge of shutting down. I was. Uh, Bleeding cash. I hadn't even paid myself in a month. Malloy received Paycheck Protection Program funds from the government this week, allowing him to keep employees like Catherine Martez on payroll. We're a little place, but we're like a big family, so we all have to take care of each other. Woodyard was among the first group of approved loans, and he hopes more small businesses will benefit in the coming days. My biggest hope is that the government, who's done something really good, can keep that good thing going and make sure everybody who's eligible gets it. Tailgate munches and carryout lunches will return inside to dine someday. We're supposed to all be in this together. Uh, we need to help each other out uh, whatever way we can. Until then, a little help keeps the home fires burning. In KCK, Nathan Vickers, KCTV 5 News.